today on review we are looking at DLC quests which you can get it over on the PC and also over on the FR 360 indie section. Well the story of DLC quests is a very short one indeed of course at the game and he put it you a hero and you might work your princess and a dude total. That pretty much the only real motivation you actually need and the game court point this out. So if you cannot tell the game is pretty much a commentary upon the whole DLC thing that have happened this generation. So the game pretty much start out with you with no animation, no music, and you only can move one way. But as you collect coins, you will unlock new abilities such as jumping, animation, music, going the opposite direction, and so on. And they pretty much get more and more seen to the point of adding zombies or putting everyone into underwear and a top hat. And so on. But the game itself, it really not really a game. It mainly made up of you walking around, jumping, collecting coin, moving on, buying the net DLC needed to get to the net area, went and repeat for about 20 minutes. The game is extremely short and a little witty here and there, and the platforming is solid overall, but it's still not really a game here. But if you want to sit back and just kind of enjoy laughing, at what gaming have become thanks to DLC, it might be worth your time. So overall, I give DLC quests for the PC a 2 out of 5.